Your Highness, may I ring the alarm? Thank you. I found this woman and her daughter with this baby at Ogumagana Forest while I was hunting. They claim to be displaced from some part of the north and that they have been wandering in the forest for the past 17 days. Hmm. And uh, she told you that this is her daughter? Yes, Your Highness, no my picky. You look too young to be the mother of this girl. I could not mean I've been small. And what about the baby? No my picking too. I see. Thank you very much for bringing them here. Hmm? Um, my queen. Yes, my king. Go and find them some very comfortable accommodation. Consider it done, my king. Find them something to eat. Hmm? Consider it done, my king. The royal guest house. You have to wait a moment for the maids to clean up the room. Yes, yes my, my friend. I thank you very much, ma. She is the queen of Abulano Autonomous Community. Address her as Your Highness. Thank you very much, thank you very much Your, Your Highness. Highness. You're welcome to our land. <laughs> Your comfort is indeed in our hearts. You're welcome. Your Highness, I shall go home now to wash up. The maids will soon be done. Thank you very much, sir. You're Thank welcome. you very much, sir. You are indeed caring. You're welcome. Your Highness, this is exactly what the gods have been waiting for. Mm, I suppose you mean that that's what the gods have been preparing us for. <laughs> I have given them some very good accommodation and I think they are enjoying it. <laughs> <laughs> it is it's really good news, Your Highness. Uh, um, <laughs> finally, the gift of the gods is eventually my first thing. <laughs> Your Highness, this calls for celebration in our land! <laughs> Your Highness, mm -hmm. I have to keep my fingers crossed until the gods finally confirm her to be their choice. <laughs> Your 
Your Highness, mm. my fellow elders, do we need a mirror to look at that which is in our palms? Mm. <laughs> it is clear that our ancestors sent those strangers so that we can meet in the minds of the gods. Mm. <laughs> what you have said uh, is true. Um, you see, when a child rushes in and tells you that he has caught an eagle, uh, don't be in a hurry to clap for him or endorse that claim. You see, because sometimes uh, when children look at vultures, they appear like eagles to them. <laughs> so, <laughs> what I am suggesting is um, we wait. Yes, we must hear from the gods. They will tell us whether this girl is their choice. Then we can proceed from there. <laughs> Thank you, Chief Priest. Your Highness, the girl is the perfect choice of the gods. Mm. May the gods be praised. Mm. It is now left to you to do what needs to be done. I shall fulfill my responsibility to the gods and my people. Spoken as it pleases the gods. The rest is left to you. It shall be done as the gods demand. From nowhere. I've always known you as a gossip. My sister, this thing has nothing to do with gossip. Ah, okay, is it a male or a female? A female, of course. A young girl I had. In that case, the demand of the gods have come to pass. Mm -hmm. My sister, the gods can never lie. I am happy for our land though. <laughs> Me too. I was afraid that a time like this will never come. And the dangers it may cause to this community. Oh. Ah, may the gods be praised. May the gods be praised, my sister. May the gods be praised. Let us go. Let us go. Let us go. Let us go.
greetings. Please accept this gift from me. You are a blessing to our land. Thank, Thank you. you. Mm. Thank you. You are welcome. Greetings. Take this gift from me. We are blessed to our land. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I send for you. I desire to compensate you for your role in ensuring the fulfillment of the program of the gods for our people. Take this envelope. The money inside is all yours. Your Highness, may you live long. But I'm not willing to collect cash reward from you for something that is of good to our land community. Besides your highness, I am also a beneficiary to the blessing that will come from. That's very thoughtful of you and um, I am proud of you as the son of this community. But you see, nobody ever turns down the gift from the king. Take that money. It's yours. May you live long, Your Thank you. Now you will swear by that money that you now have that you must not reveal the plan of this community for those strangers in our midst. I swear by this money, Your Highness, that never will I divulge the secret plan of Abulana community. Neither to it Good. I'm proud of you. May the gods lead you. You can go now. Take them every seven hours, okay? It's all right. Thank you. How much? No, you don't have to pay. Why? That's instruction from the king. Haba, but it's the king that gave me money to buy whatever I want to buy. Well, um, he ordered us not to collect money from you or from any members each time we give you services. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Thank you. So, excuse me, what's the name, please? My name is Itoa. Itoa. It's okay. Thank you. Why? Take 
Mm. They were useless. Hey, you should not take money from me. You should not take money from me. Don't worry, don't worry. Don't worry. Why is everybody refusing to collect money from me when I buy things from their shop? Ha, Ito. Is that why you're scared? Me, yeah, I'm really scared though. They said the king instructed them not to collect money from me when I get something from their shop. Are we forbidden in the village? Oh, Ito. Not at all. Not at all. No one is forbidding you or your mother. Hmm? You see, um, it is our culture in this village to treat our strangers that way, especially when they mean well. So you don't have to be scared. Hmm? Okay. But why did the king have to bring a medicine doctor to check I and my mother? Me too, huh? The king actually brought the medicine man to confirm if you and your mom mean well for this land. Abla no community loves you and your mom so much. Hmm? So you don't be scared. Okay. Yes. Uncle Akuba will be on my way now. Go well. items I got for free today, courtesy of your highness. Uh, well, thank you very much, but it's customary for our people to welcome strangers by offering them everything free of charge. So you don't have to thank me specially. This young man here is a medical doctor. I've engaged him to give attention to your mother. you Allah thank you very much your highness how much can we pay you back for all your generosity don't worry don't attempt to pay me for anything let's make sure your mother gets well first so take him to go and see your mother
Vite, qu'il faut raison. Good man, It's all right. Yes. Sir. Sorry, it pleases me to give you this. Please do accept it. I got it from my trap. Please. Accept. And once again, you are welcome to our land. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. We are happy to see you in our land. Thank you. Please come to this part of the land. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Please take this part of the land. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Thank bye. you so much. Thank, Thank you. Bye bye. Bye bye. Claim our coming is a blessing to their land. Blessing? Yes, Mama. It's their goodness to us. It's not pure. It's not pure. I think they are doing all this because of your condition. Condition? Yes. You just get as it 
thing they do me inside, like we're supposed to find out something. Eh? I've already done that. Eh? Yes. Akuba said it's the tradition of the land to show love to any stranger who mean well for the land. husband is troubled. Yes, you're right, my queen. My heart is troubled. And whenever the problem of Abelano appears to be attracting some solution, some ugly development rears its head. Now, this, this innocent child, this innocent child. But my king, you don't have to consider her innocence. The will of the courts must be done. Listen, my conscience is troubled. That's my problem. Conscience has nothing to do with this, my king. Think about the consequences if you give in to that soft side of your heart. I know there will be consequences, no doubt. I also know that the gods have decreed and because of that I have no choice. Alright, the decree of the gods must be executed. Thank you for reminding me of that. Will your reign be long, your highness? Thank you. If we still have some bush meat, get me a little quantity, it helps me to think. To forgive you for what you do me. I find it very hard to forgive you. Mama. Mama, please find a place in your heart to forgive you, Mama. Mama, I beg you. Mama, please. Mama, 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 I beg you, can you make more for this land? Eh? Can you make more for this land? Mama, but they have been nice to us. And that their niceness, now they fear me pass. That their niceness, just they fear me. They beg you, can you make more for this land? Eh? Can you make more for this village? Mama, take it to where? Take it to where? Take it to a place where they will be wicked or not, so take it to where? Take it to, to a place where we we'll pay for everything we buy. Mama, these people have been nice to us. You should be thankful to God. This land is just like a blessing to us, Mama. How about? 
Is that why you broke the plate? You threw up the food I gave to you. Give me a bed, a bed. Come on, come on, come on. Mama, it's not good though. Mama, just to come. come on for here. Take this money and buy whatever you like with it. Thank you, Your Highness. But I don't think I have a need for it. What do you mean by that? You are taking care of most of our needs. Yes, I... Uh, I agree that I've taken care of most of your needs. Yes, care. Uh -huh. But not all of them. Yes, Your Highness. But I'll work very hard to achieve the other one myself. Which one is that? Your Highness, I want to go to school to achieve my dreams. Mm. You want to go to school? Yes, Your Highness. Your Highness, why is cool? That is not what she's meant for. Mm. Mm. 
Your Highness, I think she should serve the purpose for which the gods brought her. May you live long, Your Majesty. I think we should not even consider it. Not after waiting this long for her. Your Highness, in my own opinion, she should serve her purpose. That's my humble opinion. Not after waiting this long for her. I thank all of you for your contributions. Um, you know, sometimes a butcher has to fatten his cow before killing it. I know that this situation calls for caution and um, I, 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 I will think about it. I think about it. <laughs> It is a risk to fatten this cow in question because it may outweigh its purpose. <coughs> your Highness, I am beginning to sense pity in your heart. That would be dangerous for the royal throne. The gods are wise, Your Highness. Alright, um, I thank all of you for your advice. I will think about what you have all said and um, I'll handle it my own way. As, if, as your highness, as your highness, please. I thank all of you. Good day, your highness. I am Mrs. Oka. Principal of Community Secondary School, Abilan. Is that for me, Your Highness? Yes, I did. I want you to register her in your school. Okay, Your Highness. Thank you very much, Your Highness. Thank you. You can join her. Thank you very much, Your Highness. Thank you so much. All right. <coughs> I do her. I am offering you an opportunity to acquire the education you so badly desire. You must concentrate on your studies. Now remember, to whom much is given, more is expected. You can go now. That's all I crave for, you know that. Which kind of yeah, yeah, education you they talk about? The same education. We, 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 we nearly kill us for not. My picking. I don't tell you before. Education no good for any woman when get sense. Mama, that's a lie. It's not true. And how many times you won't die? Now, now how many times you won't die for that your dream before you go wake up? Mama. My dreams can only be empty without proper education. And I don't tell you many, many times. Eh? You don't need education to take a husband. You don't need education to take learn how to cook good, good food. You don't need education to take carry belay. Eh? Mama, see. 
the kitchen, the labor room, they are all part of my existence. I know that. Mama, that's the only thing that will make me human. Like the men. Yes. Mama, see, what's good for the men is better for the women. Nami born you. Eh? Nami born you. And Nami go decide what you go do. Nobody you go decide for me. Mama. 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 Hmm? It's education or nothing. Itoha! Itoha, come back here! This picking at the year world. Which kind of picking be this one? Hey. Okay. Your Highness, we shouldn't have sent her to school. Mm, well, I don't know why you think so, but um, a good farmer would first of all till the soil, fertilize the soil before proceeding to plant. That way, it gets bigger yields. I don't mean to doubt your wisdom. But we have waited for so long for a child that go to the set. I think we can wait a little longer. Um, popular thinking might just go along with your own impression, but let me have things my own way for a change. I'm the king. May the gods bless your way, my king. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much, my queen. Um, I I would like to be left alone for now, so if you'll excuse me, let me do some thinking on my own. Okay, my king. Thank you. Using the below example to answer the following question is still the, the same solving we use. But what is said in that solving that you approximate it? Yeah, now that's why they said you should use the following example. So okay, 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 okay. Yes, let's write it down. Yeah, so we follow by this, he will approximate the the B yes. to get what we want, right? Yeah. They plus it by seven times thirty-five. Yeah. Times seven. Okay. Times thirty-five. Okay. Seven times thirty-five over <laughs> hundred. Oh, wow, mother! And so now, what is going to be done? Greetings, Your Highness. Greetings. How are you? I'm fine, thank you, Your Highness. There. Yes, mother. Please come, let me show you something. Okay. It's her. Please, she will be with you in a moment. She can't be your friend. Why, mother?
三点。What do you want? I come to see the king. Come to see the king. Yes. What for? Yes, please. It's very important. I had a terrible nightmare concerning the strangers. Please, I just need to see the king. A Please. terrible nightmare, you see. Yes. It's a melting that happens in the night, so just go. You can't see the king based on that. Please, Please I need to see him. I said, go home! Please. I just need to see the king. Yeah. Please. He's very urgent. Please, let me see him. But I need! Yourself the dreamer. <laughs> Education is a vehicle that carries you to your chosen destination. But it must be driven by you for you to need education. First, you must have a destination. And what is that destination? Destination is a chosen career, which is what you will be in future. I mean, what you children will be in future. Now, tell me, how many of you here already have a dream career? Yes, it will her. Let us know your dream career. Thank you very much, Ma. Ma, I want to become a renowned professor of law. Class, class for her. So, tell us, why do you choose to be a professor of law? I want to become a professor of law so I can institute laws and protect the right of the girl child. And why are you particular about girl child education? The girl child education is long treated with a very low importance. The girl child is subjected to small or no dream, but I believe she will perform better than the cultural limitation placed on her especially by our native African tradition. Class, put your hands together for her. Brilliant, brilliant. Arusiani Abulan no Apagina Bam Kenge Pudunu. Apagina Bam Kenge Pu. Oh, my chief priest, cut out all that incantation and tell me why you're here. Mm. The gods have lost patience with you, my highness. But the gods should know that I'm close to executing their orders. Mm. It is only the minds of the gods that I have just spoken to you. I know. I am not one to shirk my responsibility. That's not part of my weakness. If I say I am close to executing the orders of the gods, I mean exactly what I have said. I know what my responsibilities are, and I will not relent in carrying them out. Then, may the gods of our ancestors be with you. Go in peace. Hmm. Wait, 
실한 보스크 So, so how are you? I did fine. I brought you this bush meat. Thank you very much. Thank you. Yeah. I should be on my way now. Hmm? Um, Ifuba. Hey. Here, just the room for my mind. Mm. But why? The kind dream when I dreamed last night about the good things when your people they do. They fear me. <laughs> See, uh, Mami Toa, that should not bother you. Hmm? You see, our people love strangers a lot. Treat them like semi god. In fact, it was transferred to us from our forefathers. Mm. Huh? Mm. You don't finish. That is all for now. But if you still want to hear more, just wait for another seven days. Seven days? <laughs> what did they happen for seven days? Mami Toa, mm? enjoy your meat. Seven days. It's all her. Why did you say all that about girls today? Daya, it's a long painful story, my dear. A painful story, you say? Yes. <laughs> my father came from a tribe where the girl child is treated as a modern slave. What? You're forced to marry when you're not ready. You're denied education and you refer to us as a baby manufacturing machine. Look, my mother gave birth to me when she was 13. Yes. And my father betrothed me to a wealthy man when I was two years old. And when my father died, he came to take me as his wife, but I refused. That's the cause of I and my mother's problem today. I'm very sorry. Is that why your mother's leg was amputated? Yes. It's a really painful story. That's one of the consequences of disobeying the tradition of my tribe. Although she did not support my decision. So I'm very sorry, okay? All the, all the fine. All is gone. So once more, I welcome all of you. Yeah. What is your honest? I've gone to Ojaji's house as instructed, but it's not feeling fine, Your Highness. Okay. It's all right. Let's go back to the covers faster. We can go now. So I tell you why I assembled all of you. I made up my mind to do as the gods commanded. <laughs> Your Highness, thank you for your decision. We rejoice with you and the entire people of Abulano village. Hmm. 
Igwe. Your Highness, I think there is something that we need to do before moving on. Um, if I may suggest, Igwe, uh, let us confirm that that girl is not the true mother of that baby. Uh, that is my humble suggestion, Your Highness. <clears throat> Your Highness, that is exactly the same question that is running through my mind. Whenever I see that girl, This is a very fine observation. I do have hard to think about this thing quite honestly because that is one thing that must disqualify her. If she is the mother of that baby, she's disqualified. Because if she's not a virgin, then she has no business being the church of the gods. Exactly. Well, I shall proceed to confirm that. Igwe! that you are the mother of that baby. Why didn't you open up to us so that we can take good care of you? Your Highness, that information is wrong. How would I have given birth at my age? <laughs> it's okay, I understand. Maybe you're feeling shy to open up, but don't worry, okay? Your secret is safe with me. Tell me, who is the father of that child? Your Highness, he's my younger brother. Oh, Our father is Leeds, and whoever might have given you that information is wrong. My mother gave birth to him six months before her accident. Okay, Ito. I believe you. But do not hesitate to share your deepest secret with me. You can count on me. Did you get it? Yes, Your Majesty. Thank you. It's okay. So how is your mother? She's fine. You're taking care of her? Yes. It's okay. Emergency. Oh, where is Itoa? It is very urgent. You didn't fear me. Talk to me. What did happen? Where is Itoa? What did happen now? Okay, she come out. Don't worry. Don't bother anymore. I must find Itoa. Oh, oh, no, you didn't fear me. What did happen? What did happen now?
see, from now on, anybody that asks you about your little baby brother, tell the person that he is your son. Ah. Do you hear me? Why? Keep saying yes. Yes, yes, and nothing but yes. Boy, he's my brother. Just do as I have said. I overheard the discussion in there on your way home back from school. I believe in your dream. Akuba, I don't understand what you are saying. I don't understand it's you. It's all right. The only way you understand what I'm saying is to just do what I have said. Keep saying yes. Akuba, the queen interrogated me earlier and I told her the truth. So I don't understand what you are saying now. You did? Yes. Hey! Arwe, man. Uh, what happened now? Akuba. Hey! Akuba. Talk to me now. What's happening? Akuba, what's happening now? Akuba. not something you should cry about. It is the will of the gods and it must be done. Your Highness, that's why I'm big. It's one big past me while lying. Look, it will be a blessing to this community. It will make you a very happy person forever. Look at this entire royal household. This is where you will belong and will be taking care of you for the rest of your life. Can't you understand? You can do this. Now because of this same matter, I nearly died. Because of this same matter, I made that this condition when I did. Because of this same matter, I made me and my children run over for not enter the bush. <laughs> it's okay. Look, there is no doubt that the God brought you here for this same purpose. Like the king has said, you will be greatly appreciated. You will be well taken care of. Stop crying, okay? Why are you a nana? <laughs> Why are you a nana? <laughs> Greetings, Your Highness. Crying. Why you Anana? Mom. 
mama. Me up, No more, Itoha, for you have only found favor in the eyes of the gods. If the gods want to favor me, then they should allow me live my dreams. Mm. The gods have already helped your dreams to come true. For it's a tradition in Abulano Kingdom that the king shall have a male child before he sits on the throne for 20 years our present king has ruled the land for 19 years now he has taken five wives but none none of them have given him a son none has given him a son mm. it is for this reason that the great oracle of our land the great arusiana has predicted that for the king to have a son he must marry a virgin from another tribe who must be below the age of 18. you have been chosen it is your destiny to become the saving queen of abolano kingdom <laughs> and and I congratulate you, Your Highness. It's too late for this unholy choice of a god. It's too late. I have chosen the path to go. My education remains my husband till I achieve my dreams. A new man, born of a human can make me change my direction impossible mm. 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 do you know what it means for you to be the mother of a queen the blessings and privileges that come with royalty do you know the respect the dignity the affluence you will have. Think of it. Your daughter will be parading with the king. You will have everything at your disposal. And you will also belong to one of the decision makers in this Abolamu. If you know what you gained in this Abolamu village, I bet you you in a hurry embrace the blessing that is coming from the gods. Your Highness, I want it. I like it. After all, it won't take when I did so far. But there is problem. The problem now, my daughter. Eh? Is she? But you are into her mother. The honest is for you as the mother to give her hand in marriage. You will enjoy it. You will. I'm not against it. Eh? I'm not against it. After all, me said I married when I swore. I support it. Thank you very much for being with me. I will proceed with the marriage arrangements. Thank you very much. 
Congratulations for accepting to be the mother of the queen. So I just have to. But you knew all this why. And you're hiding it from me. It's all right. I tried to save you, but it was too late. It's never too late. No. I know what I want. And I cannot be deceived to accept just anything. Listen to her. Our tradition forbids a woman from turning down the king's proposal. Fine. Fine. Then I'm leaving this village with my family immediately. I'm going. Listen, I cannot guarantee you such at the moment. It is only the king that has the power to take such decision. But let me warn you, you must be careful with whatever you are deciding. From this very moment, it will. Every little time you spent with me is not a risk to my life. Please, it will. I beg you. Separate from me. Go and convey her belongings to my chambers. The mandate of the gods must take precedence over the whims of men and must be executed to the letter. Go. May your tomb be wrong, your highness. Let's go. Thank you. Are they going to be so cool? Come, 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 you know what? My sister, what does a stranger know now? What does a stranger know? I thought you've heard now. So please, do not say it to me. My daughter, I have always told you say marriage now be the pride of woman. You can't go get your legs saying a king now they come for you. Hmm? You, 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 know, you know say, you know do plenty things for us. Now, King, now be the solution to our problem. I they beg you. I they beg you with my life. Grief for the King now. Your Highness, I am so happy for you. You should be the most proud woman of our land, having been chosen by the gods. I mean, I know you're not expecting this at this time. But the gods, knows the best for you. <laughs> you know say I born you when I small. Like when I small like this. These people they don't do plenty, plenty good things for us. If God say now you be the person when go give king, man picking. Accept now with good mind. <laughs> Mama. Mama. Mama, Mama, while life we are leaving this village first thing tomorrow morning, perhaps that will change the choice of the gods. You must not do such a thing, Itoa. You must have to be very careful before you land yourself into a serious big trouble. The gods of our land is no respecter of any person. What's your problem?
My elder, why did you bring me here? Uh, look at the expanse of this land. It is all yours. Listen, the king will provide the people that will work for you. The king will also give you guards and men that will always be with you. Listen to me. Power and wealth will be in your hand like a dining spoon. And your entire life will be garnished with everlasting royalty. All you need to do is to say yes to the king's proposal. And every blessing, in fact, all these blessings become yours. That's all. My elder, all these things you just showed me and the promises the king made to me just added to the beauty of life. My elder, the most beautiful thing in life is the fulfillment of one's dream. I came from a part of the world where the girl child is trained not to have a dream of her own. Our culture and tradition and the flashy society have cornered the girl child to the receiving end of every societal disaster. I, Itoa, have vowed to make a change with my story. And sorry, my elder, I cannot repeat the mistake of my mother. The king has treated you with a kid glove enough. His tolerance is fast vanishing. Listen, you must help yourself enough as soon as possible from his life. I have delivered the message from the king. This is what every woman has for. Actually, it is very, very rare for the gods to choose a wife, a king. But when they do, it brings great joy to the chosen. She is not only respected as the queen, but also as one chosen by Arusiana to bring great joy and happiness to the people of Abulano land. <laughs> yes, your highness. And you will become the greatest of all king's wife. And the present queen will leave the palace for you and relocate to royal chamber. Now you'll be in full control of all the powers that govern the land. What else is greater than this, Your Highness? My vision, my mission, my destiny, my aspirations. They are much more greater than all this which you just mentioned. Look, I want to be a queen of my destiny. Not a queen under a king, no. The greatest thing I need now is a proper education. My elders, and I can't succumb to anything less. But the king has given you education, yes. Then let's end it at that. I cannot compromise my education for anything. <clears throat> um, Your Highness, um, like who was saying? Um, Good night, my elders. Hello, lads. Hello, ma'am. Our last lesson we learned the citizenship and the fundamental human rights. Who can explain the meaning of citizenship? Nobody? Yes. Ma, citizenship can be defined 
as the ability to exercise the rights and privilege that come with being a member of a particular country. Give her a clap. Now to the lesson, we have fundamental human rights. And this fundamental human rights, we are going to treat child rights. Now from our previous knowledge, who can tell us the meaning of child rights? Yes. A child is anyone who is 18 or below. The UN General Meeting on 20th November 1989 adopted the National Union Convention of the Rights of a Child. And the AU adopted the rights of a welfare in 1990. The 1990s were proclaimed Decade of the African Child by OAU. And the Day of the African Child was set aside on 16th of June every year. Thank you, Ma. Clap for her. Things and leave the class. The admission has been terminated now. Ma. I said, pick your things and leave your mama and me. Mama. No. The king instructed that she picks nothing. Therefore, leave. I don't. Leave the class. I don't understand. I don't. I want to achieve my dreams here. Move! Please, Ma. Stand up and walk out! Please, safety of my palace. 
which means you are one person she is used to. In other words, you have become some kind of confidant to her. Whatever you tell her, she's likely to believe because she's used to you. I have invited you here so I can exploit your attachment to her. I want you to go to her. Convince her of the need to get married to the king. Tell her it is the will of the gods, and by doing that she'll be fulfilling her own destiny. Tell her that. I shall do as the king has commanded. Your Highness, I shall be on my way now. Your Highness, I will seek for a little time. You know she's only about a child. You dare to refer to my queen as a child? Uh, pardon me, Your Highness. I was only trying to say that uh, she's a stranger. And she's yet to adapt. That stranger has become my wife. She's my wife. It's your duty to persuade her. Now go and do as you're told. I will, my king. Good. For our nose. Hmm? Abba, Mama. This is a counterfeit blessing. Mama, not every open door is a blessing. Mother, I know what I want. And if I can achieve it, don't be order me to, to impact what I want, Mama. Itoha. Queen means blessing. Hmm? Queen means dignity. Queen means all the better, better, better things. Eh? Mama, not the kind of queen I want to be. Mama, no. Mama, I want to be a professor of law. To defend the girl child. Mama, it's well defined. Mama, I stand for what I stand for. And I can't compromise it for anything. No, not at all. Professor, bow to the Queen, Your Highness. Ojoto, Ojoto. Ojoto, Ojoto. Now you are Give me the overnight now. now what are you waiting for? Ah, uh, I've told you several that I'm saving my pan wine for the Igwe ceremony that is coming up. Which marriage? Uh, uh, the Igwe marriage, of course. <laughs> Ojoto, you better say your pan wine. Unless you want your pan wine to spoil. And be invested with maggots. Hmm? Now, your guys, this pan wine is made for Igwe marriage alone. If you want beer, I have beer. I have beer. Ojoto, I need overnight, Ojoto. That's an Igwe ceremony. Igwe's marriage. Oh, Ojoto, I bring the beer now. Mm. Oh. Let me just manage it. How are you looking now? Mm. But do not say I did not warn you, Ojoto. More beer, more beer. Thank you. Let me just manage mm -hmm. here. Man. When you get to the Igwe marriage, in one zip and one. No problem. Let me just manage here. Hmm? Hey. Your Highness, I don't want you to face the wrath of the chief priest. Marry the king and let peace reign. 
There's only one definition of peace for me, and that's fulfillment. I must fulfill my glorious destiny, and it starts for my education. Your Highness, if you marry the king, you will have money, fame, farms, lands, clothes, and every other good thing that comes with education. It will be a taboo for you to turn down the king's proposal. If you marry the king, you can still go back to school. There you'll be more respected as the queen of Abulano community. The king loves you and he means well for you. Even the gods who have chosen you equally means well for you. Your Highness, you know where you are coming from. And this will be a breakthrough for you and your family. Your Highness, the gods are wise. Please, Your Highness, think about it. Your Highness, please marry the king. to pass through these tribulations to attend the prestigious positions. <laughs> Do you all have to fight for your dreams at every point of life? Why is Rumel world so full of limitations? Why can't a woman have the rights to choose what they become in the future? Come pay your bride price. By this time tomorrow, my Pekin will become the queen of Abulanu land. <laughs> Mama, by this time in the nearest future, you thought I would be a professor of law. I know. <laughs> King, say. He go put you for school after the marriage. <laughs> Mama, you should have cared to know if that's what I want. Mama, education and marriage are two different things. We must have to do one before the other, Mama. <laughs> Don't start that thing when you do for not. Oh. Don't be that one when um, Allah nearly kill me. Now we don't call you now. You won't call risk my own life, ba? You no know, go work. Whether you like him or you don't know, like him, you go marry him tomorrow. I don't talk my own feelings. Closed door between the elders and our queen mother to be. 
Everybody is expected to greet the new queen at the palace. Oh, yeah, no, I got it, yo. Congratulations, Your Highness. Am I the sweet me well well? Hmm? Finally, I go become mama of queen. No cry, yeah. I know say this is your tears, not tears of joy. Hmm? I go greet you again. Congratulations, Your Highness. Is the latest queen of Abulamna not looking charming? She fine, where, where? <laughs> Abulamna land is pleased to have you, your highness. Look, maiden, get the animal skin, let her place her leg on it. The hair, the hair, please try and comb it very well. Make her look beautiful. Like she is. It's normal. It's normal. <laughs> What happened? Ah. Ah. What happened? What did ah. I do? What did you do? It's all you okay? Babe? Ah. Oh. To her with her marriage entitlements. That will be fine. At least that makes her your wife by tradition. My king, I wish to remind you of our earlier arrangement before I supported this marriage. The arrangement still stands. I mean, the moment she gives me my son, I will execute the arrangement. That is not the arrangement, my king. The arrangement is immediately you get married to her. I have spoken. And I am the king. Stand up and they address their. Oh, you know, <laughs> <laughs> I greet you once again, uh, mother of our queen to be. <laughs> yes, His Royal Highness, the Igwe of Abulama Kingdom, has sent us with part of the marriage entitlements, mm. and uh, these are the things we have brought here, so that. Uh, the move can begin for the marriage. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, that, that is the message. Yeah. Uh, if there's anything I am missing, 
Please remind me. No. Oh uh, no, you are on point. I'm on point. Okay. Yes. yes. <laughs> More will still come. Part of it. This is part of it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, now thank you very well, well, well. Eh? Thank you. My mind sweets me well, well. As soon as I take home, bring all these things. Eh? When I help me thank the king, go. Eh? He do well. Yeah, Tell yeah. her, say, I accept her. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> The message sent to the smoke must get to heaven. <laughs> yes, I assure you. <laughs> eh? Eh, there's one other thing. Okay. We need to take a message back to our king. Uh, so I know that uh, our queen to be is in there. <laughs> can please use someone her? So eh, that we can we'll appreciate her. Yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Ito her, my fine picking. Ito her, fine girl. Come, come, come. Your husband's a dog, come. Ito her. She's got a wine. I'm a master. My fine picking, I'm a bona. This is a queen befitting for our king. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes. 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 And yes. This, this, this. Why do you want to force a little girl into marriage when all she desires is to go to school and fulfill her dreams? Let me tell you all, Itoha can never, never marry my father. <laughs> Otherwise, Find her if you can. What, what, what kind of insult is this? What kind of nonsense is this? I demand an explanation. Tell us. Let us go. Now let's get out. This is nonsense. Now let's get out of this. I need to leave this village now. You understand the roots even more than I do. Please show me. I need to leave this village. I beg you, Uncle Akuma. Please, please, you have to leave immediately. Any moment you stay here is a threat to my life. I have told you before. Please leave. Please Ito, now. go. Go, you put me in trouble. Go. Uncle Akuma, please now. Go, please, please, just go. Please. 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 Please now. Please, please. Show me the roots. Ito, go. go. Please leave. <laughs> You put me in trouble, you go! Ito, what are you doing here? You should be getting married today, I heard. Mrs. Atu. You alone taught me how to pursue my dreams and aspirations. And you alone also know why I don't want to get married to the king. I can't find my way out. Please help me. What you ask of me is dangerous. If anyone finds you and I here, then I'm doomed. You're my teacher. You taught me how to pursue my dreams. And you say we should make every possible sacrifice to pursue it. Please help me out. It's okay. It's okay. You see, I will only show you the way out. That's all I can do for you. Okay? Thank you very much. You're welcome. Thank you, ma'am. You are nearly right. You are nearly right, but nearly cannot kill a bird. Even once. It's the best thing in there, sir. I'm not going to lie. Don't insult me. Don't insult me. I'm not going to lie. Oh, Joto. Oh, Joto. Oh, Joto. I don't know if you're not going to lie. Oh, Joto. Come and give me a drink before I transfer my aggression to you now. Oh, Joto! Ah, ah. Do you know why now? Do you know why? Ah, ah. I'm bleeding it. Can't you see it? Ah. Look at this one. Though. He's even expressing anger. Was I the one who told you to reserve your drinks for the Ugo's marriage? Oh! 
a marriage that was only but a sham. A sham? Do you want to Igwe this? did not consult with me. Ever my baby go or not. I lived 30 years in Borono. 15 years in Adamawa. 15 years in uh, Kengana Bova uh, Gombe. Igwe, Gombe. Igwe, 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 Let me tell you, you lied. Igwe allowed them to flog him 50 stroke of Ken. You don't understand? Igwe, 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 what they like a baby. And, the, and that's the only reason. As is not, not you're going to marry someone. Say, make sure you can. No, make sure oh, you can. No. Say what you know. I can see that what the thing you are taking is 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 affecting your medulla abukata. Don't insult me. That is the main reason the marriage was cancelled. I said keep quiet. Mbaka. Mbaka. One Maya. Adolto. One Maya. One Maya. Ibo ya. Ibo ya. One Maya. One Maya. One Maya. Le Maya. Maya. Le Ben Maya, on a Ben Maya. Say drink, you don't want to sell. You go marriage, you go marriage. If you go there, you go book again, bang. You go marriage. You go a lawyer and also not die. Your Highness, since she is insisting on going to school, why not promise her that you will send her back to school after her fourth child? The son could be the one your highness is seeking. <clears throat> well, I have told her all that, but uh, I have not managed to convince her. This is a huge problem. Of all the strangers in this village, she is the one chosen by the gods. And uh, she is proving impossible. <laughs> well, I. I wouldn't say she's proven impossible. Um, uh, she's not used to our culture. I have paid her bride price. And if you pay somebody's bride price, she uh, automatically becomes your wife. So no matter where she runs to, my guards will fetch her. She's my wife. <laughs> and uh, the person that the guards have destined to give me a son. <laughs> so she will come back. Uh, Your Highness. Yes, you come back. Your faith gives me much hope. The gods will help. I know that. They will. The gods will. So I forgot to ask you what about your wife? How is she doing? Where is she? I don't know her whereabouts. Believe me. Now listen. She couldn't have discussed her whereabouts with anyone but you, Akuba. If I may ask you, would you like to taste the rot of the king? How could you think that I would betray my land? My own Abulano community. I can't do such things. Akuba, you have till sunset to provide her. Failure to do so, you answer to the king. Let's go.
to Education is a key for the reason. and buy us some food. My brother is too hungry. Okay. Madam, please give her more food. Thank you very much, ma. Weep no more. The royal guards will surely find her wherever she is. Why? 
Trinez! Dar ești Trinez! Trinez, nu vreau să mai dau da, mai smă pici! Ah! Un live de Londai! Okay. Nothing will happen to them, okay? She will be somewhere in this village. Not to worry, okay? Not to worry. The king has ordered and asked the whole village to join in the search. Oh! Itoa! Itoa! Itoa, why you do me this thing? Why are you doing it? Okay. Stop crying. Ah. Oh. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's It all started from the notes. Before my dad died, he betrayed me to an Alahaji. And when my father finally died, the Alahaji came to marry me, but I refused. My mother wanted me to marry him so I can fend for my family. The Alahaji unleashed war on my mother claiming it's my mother that asked me not to marry him. So we were attacked. And my mother lost her leg in the process. That was how we ran away from the nuts. Now, the king of the village, Iranto, is also asking your hand in marriage. What a wicked word. I have always desired dedication since my childhood. I have always desired to be different from what the society wants the girl child to become. I have promised myself to become the agent of change. Please, ma, I know you can help me. All I need is education. I can serve you in your house. Don't give me money. Just send me to school. Give me food. Provide for me and my brother. Please, ma, I know you can do it. I beg you in the name of Allah. Please. I know you can do it for me and my brother. Please. I beg of you. Please. It's okay. It's okay. Thank you very much, ma. Welcome. 
chief priest. I sent for you. Mm. It's been four days since my supposed wife disappeared from the palace. We've searched everywhere for her. She's not been found. What do I do? <laughs> but your highness, the gods have given us the powers to help ourselves at times like this. Hmm? I have searched every nook and cranny of this community. She is nowhere to be found. So, as a mo, what do I do? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> then permit me, Your Highness, to jump her to be talk. Ordinarily, that should be your responsibility. I don't have to give you permission for that. Having said that, Chief Priest, I don't care how you return her to the palace. Just do me one thing. Bring her back to the palace. You mm -hmm. It is settled, Your Highness. You could be. You could be. You could be. Hello, Chief. Yeah, it's me, Madam Sugar. Yeah, I have exactly what you want. Perfect sex, perfect age, no stress. So, what is your offer? No, 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 Chief. No, 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 no. It can't be as usual. No, Chief, I know what it costs me to get this one from a very deep village in the north. No, I can't take that. Okay, I go for one million. Yes. You can pass delivering. Okay. It's a deal. Thank you. Yes, ma'am. Thank you very much. It's okay. I guess you need more. This will do. God bless you, ma'am. It's okay. Not to worry. Hmm? I'll make sure you go to one of the big schools in town to fulfill your dream. Okay? And I'll take good care of you like my own child. Before you know it, you become a renowned professor of law and prove your mother wrong. But for now, you stay with me in my hotel till I return to my home in Lagos. Better we stay here for as long as we can than taking such news to the king. 
I disagree with you on this one, Ogata. We've searched every nook and cranny of this kingdom, yet we couldn't find her. The best thing we do now is to go back to the king and give him the situation report. I can take your right. For the heart of the king, it is better we go back on time and give him the report of our search. You should be the one to tell him that Saturday nothing. But I am not leaving here if I don't get uh, Akuba or Doha. I'm not even here if I don't get that over or you don't have. I've told you before now. Where are you going? Are you mad? I'm the chief. Come on, let's go. Why are you going to I'm the chief guard. Come back here. Yeah, let's go. I don't know what you say.
Hello. Huh? My fellow. Huh? How are you? I'm fine. How's your family? I'm fine. I'm fine. How's everything? I, it is, I, I want to believe it is well. Eh? Yes. It is. It is. Uh, I wonder why the Igwe has summoned us to the palace. And that is why I am rushing to meet up. Oh. Maybe you want to see her opinion over the whole happening. Hmm. Listen, if I am to suggest, uh -huh. I'll advise the king to go to a faraway tribe huh? and pick another bride. Huh? Yes, there are many girls of Ituha's age out there who are willing to settle down with a man, let alone a king. No, but the girls have chosen Ituha now. Forget about that. Huh? See, listen, the gods can see she's proving impossible. And if the king does not get a new bride and impregnate her before the end of a month from now, I fear for his throne. To fear what? But it goes for me. That is why I am suggesting he goes to a faraway land to pick another bride. Ah. May the gods for me. May the gods for me. To fear. Let's go. Let's May the gods for me. We'll find out. Let's go to the and first have Madame Sugar, and Madame Sword. Hey, she stole my baby brother. I'm looking for my name is Madame Sugar. Have you not said we can give her enough for her money, Abby? I did not say him. I did not say him. He sent me on an errand. Though. Well, let me advise you. Next time, he said we can stay there for her money. I did not say my baby brother. <laughs> Oh, 
itora tije ye tije bali yo wan eji ndu ya ka ma ko marama ma ka de o sora
to know your highness. As the gods buy my picking as promise. You know, you're a very attractive woman. How come you gave birth to such a rude girl? A girl that had the impudence, the audacity to run out of this palace inconvenienced me to the point where I sent all my guards to be searching for her. After all what I did for you and your daughter. Your Highness, I beg, make you no verse. Eh? I won't give my picking to you for marriage. Eh, I beg, make you no verse. Guards! Your Highness. Take her out. Your oh, Highness, I beg now. My queen. I don't want to see her here again. Your husband. Yes, folks. Your stay here is no longer needed. Go and perish in your own misery. Take her out! Move! My queen, mercy me now, eh? Move! Your Highness, mercy me now, eh? Your Highness, mercy me now, eh? My queen! Move before you start. Out! Move! Mercy me now, eh? Go inside there, pick one of her belongings and throw them out! Keep moving! No, no, no! I bought all those things for her. She's going to leave this place as poor as she was before she came in. Get her, get out. Don't give her anything. Yes! Get out! Out! Take her out! out. Guards, throw her out and lock that gate. Don't let her come in. Nonsense. Me. Me. Now they me. Me. Let me you kidnap me. You don't kidnap me. You don't You don't kill me. You will go to today. Wait, 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 wait. I go beat you, eh? You don't kill that girl. I did not kill her. I did not kill her. I want to believe now. I want to believe now. You're a kidnapper. You're a kidnapper. Bros, bros, need that first. Need that, bros. Nida first, you're a kidnapper. I know, I know, I know. Nida, Nida, Nida. But you pursue that girl. Why is she? Why is she? You run. Let me tell you. That girl is from my village. She ran away. The king of my village sent me to the city to come and look for her. And immediately I saw her. She started running away. I'm pushing her to come back. No, be honest. You tell that on a police. You go tell her. Liar. Police. Liar. You 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 want her to come back. You wanted to kidnap that girl. That's why she ran away. I'm not a kidnapper. How will I believe now? I am a hunter. Believe me, believe me. Not so good because believe okay, me. Okay, see, see. If you are doubting me, eh? I will take you to my village. You can meet the king of my village and ask him. He will tell you that I am a hunter. Village girl. Me, me, go, go, go to your village. Ta! Police. They go, 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 go police. Police. No, they go to police. No, they go police. Okay. Go here. Stand up. They go to police. That's what they repeat. Stand up. You go. Okay, stand up. Let's go. You go to the station. Go to now. I'm not going to be on that. I'm not going to be on that. I'm not going to be
Iwe, your highness, since the situation has turned out this way, may we know our next line of action? Yes, your highness. May we know? Because I'm worried. We are worried too. Hmm. Well, the way things are, we don't have a choice but to acquire another stranger as fast as possible. Your Highness, have the gods spoken concerning this situation? Your Highness. Uh, the chief priest is expected to be at this meeting. Because it is the voice of the gods, let's find out what he has learned from the gods. Your Highness, it is time that I am worried about. How soon can we get another stranger? Bring in another stranger. Get confirmation from the ghost. And then uh, conduct the marriage. <laughs> Tell me what the gods have said regarding our situation. Exactly. Mm. Mm. I will see a niabula no aquadica na ju no 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 no. Aquadica na ju no ne ju ra ju ju asaya no no. Your Highness, it is good that you asked. But then, first things first. Gods of Itoha must be retrieved as tradition demands and buried in Abulano soil because you already paid her bride price. Yes, she is your wife. Hmm. Nurse, my name is um, Pastor Joseph Ehiri. I am the General Overseer for Evangelical Missions. That's pressing forward Evangelical Missions. I yesterday I actually accidentally ran into a girl, and I heard that she was brought to this hospital for medical attention. I ran to the police station to report myself because of jungle justice that is quite prevalent in this time in our country. So I just came to check how far she's recuperating. I'm so sorry, she didn't make it. No, 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 it's not possible. I'm talking about a young girl. I ran her, yes, but... She died immediately. She was rushed in here. God! How? I'm so sorry. She didn't make it. No, 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 no. That's not possible. I'm talking about a small girl. I know. She died immediately. She was rushed in here. No! She can't die. No, oh, Jesus! I'm so sorry. Jesus Christ. I just killed an innocent girl. Oh God. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Oh God, forgive Highness, may you live long. 
I went to the city to look for a tour as you instructed. And on seeing me, she ran away. In the same process he went, she was knocked down by a hit and run driver. Mm. As I was trying to recover from the shock of what happened, this policeman here came and arrested me, claiming that I was trying to kidnap it to her. Igwe! We want to confirm whether this man actually knows the girl in question. He's mm. tall. She ran away from here, from this compound. And I instructed all my subjects to look for her and bring her back. And that's precisely what he was doing. He was obeying my instructions. Yes. Thank you. Thank you, Hannes. Good. Yeah, no. So, any problems? Any further problems? No. Yes. Yeah, thank you, Steve. Thank you. Can go now. Igwe. Uh, car. This is the first time I'm witnessing a miracle of this month. Nurse, are you sure of what you are saying that Itoha is alive? Everything happened in my very presence. The pastor prayed and wept and the dead girl began to cough. Thanks to the God of our ancestors. Thanks to the God of our beloved community. <sighs> Where is she? And the pastor took her to a specialist hospital down the road. Where is the specialist hospital located? Mm. So just, if you just go down to the road, there's another junction by the Thank you very much. <laughs>
Your Highness, contrary to our belief that she died in the accident, she survived it. What? She survived? Yes. She survived? Where is she? She was rushed to the hospital. Which hospital? Which hospital? We were able to locate the hospital. Yes. How is she doing? How is she? How is she? Where is she? Um, um, Your Highness. Yes. When we got to the hospital. Yes. The nurse that was in charge of her. Yes. Said she went to the room where she was kept. Mm -hmm. And she was nowhere to be found. Your Highness. She disappeared. What did you say? She disappeared. She disappeared. Yes, yes. Now listen to me, you two. Go and find her wherever she is and bring her here. I don't want excuses at all. Your Highness. Uh, yes, Your Highness. And Akuma, you listen to me. If you don't find that girl, you'll be sorry. Okay, Your Highness. is rare in this generation. Her character is worthy of emulation. For a girl of her age to know her ambitions and her dreams is something remarkable. I want to really thank you for nurturing her in a way that is very peculiar. You know, it is not just the responsibility of a mother to give the child food, but also to throw the child in the right path. Thank you. But Pastor, that is how my mama and my papa take bring me up. I marry when I date 12 years old. That is the reason why God has given you a child that is ready and determined to correct all the societal ills. Um, we are ready, the church and I, we are ready to take care of our education to any level yes pastor thank you very much thank God you pastor. bless you thank you thank you you deserve the best and for your mother we will set up a business for you business for me yes. 
Thank you very much, Pastor. Thank God will bless you. Kingship should come to my family. <laughs> See, it is tradition that if the Igwe does not have a son until after 20 years of his reign, the kingship will, will leave his family. Ah! Hey, Igwe. Hey! 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 Ah! Hey! 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 The, 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 the gods, the, the, the gods did not say that, that, that you should marry any stranger. I fabricated that lie. Hey, 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 hey! I chose it all because because I knew she would never agree to abandon her education and uh, and ambition. I, I am also the cause of Itoha's accident.
Bread Queen. Congratulations, my queen.